negative keyword lists. All right, let's talk negative keyword lists. So keyword lists are great because you can apply them to multiple campaigns very easily. It gives you a nice central place to manage everything so you don't have to go into each campaign separately and add your negative keywords and then it, I don't know, it gets difficult to kind of monitor if you added them to this one or the other one or you have to remember to add them. And as, as your account starts to grow, this can become pretty, pretty cumbersome. And a lot of times you'll want to add the same keywords to all your campaigns if you're managing other people's accounts. A lot of times it's the same, same type of things you want to exclude, at least initially. So let's show you how to do this. If you have this little tab closed, just open it up and then click the shared library and then the campaign negative keywords right here. Click that and I you'll see I have one created and I only have a few keywords in it, but it's nice you can see how many campaigns it's applied to and then how many keywords you have in it. But we'll start from scratch here. And so you just need to give it a name and we'll say uh, campaign negatives. And then you just add a list of keywords. So to give you a good starting point, I have written a post and then also attached a an Excel file down below this video. So you'll be able to download that and kind of look through it and see if a lot of those might apply to your your campaigns as well. And in this case, I'll hop over to this post and you'll see I have it organized by category. So, you know, there's job related kind of research type things, learning and examples and um, you know computer a lot of download freeware games those type of things so lots of stuff and I'll show you how to add these if you download the Excel file you can just copy and paste from there or you can copy and paste right from this post so let's say all these job related keywords I don't want to show up when um, for people searching for my keywords so we will just copy those hop right back over here and paste and I'll just paste them in a nice line just like that click Save and you'll see it creates this campaign negatives tells us how many keywords and right now it's applied to zero campaigns so when you first create this it's important that you click on this and then apply to campaigns and you'll see there's a list of the campaigns you can apply it to you can choose a few you can choose them all and then just click save and you'll see this number of campaigns gets updated and it's really it's really that simple so if you you know you find new keywords you want to add you can just come right back over click add and you get a box where you can kind of do the same thing so if a few more here apply i can just copy and paste those and it just takes a second those get added and then you can also click here and if you want to change your match type for your negative keywords you can change it to exact or phrase I would stay away from exact because that would mean that someone would have to search for about and only about so you probably wouldn't be targeting that so it doesn't make a lot of sense and for negative keywords broad and phrase are actually the same thing if you're only have a single word negative keyword so that would be the same another thing to remember is that you will need to add singular and plural you'll see this is book and books so Google makes you add all the variations for negative keywords so remember to do that if you need to add you know different tenses hire hiring those type of things be sure and do that but it's as, as simple as that and you know you can always come back in here apply it to campaigns just make sure that as you do this you aren't excluding searches that you do want to show up for so you need to make sure and think about that if it's something like jobs or job and you know you're targeting like a made job you know someone sometimes people search for things weird ways so it's just a thing to keep in mind but it's really it's really that simple but very effective